And the Oscar goes to Emma Stone. In a neck and neck race with Lily Gladstone, Emma Stone was not expecting to hear her name read as the winner of the Best Actress Oscar, but I think also contributing to her look of terror <laughs> was the fact that Emma realized there'd be no hiding her wardrobe malfunction as she made her way up the stairs to the podium. I think Emma mouthing, my dress is broken to Jessica Lange and Charlize Theron was more for the viewing audience than telling the two fellow Best Actress winners because what are they going to do about it in that moment? <laughs> Charlize reassures her and tells her she looks amazing and yeah, she did. And Emma assumed the cameras were capturing her back as she walked up the stairs but yeah, we didn't actually see it at all. It was Emma's second Best Actress win after winning in 2017 for La La Land. Ryan Gosling, thank you for making me laugh <laughs> and for always raising the bar and for being the greatest partner on this crazy adventure. And she blamed her broken dress on that film's co-star. Oh boy, um, my dress is broken. <laughs> I think it happened during I'm Just Ken. <laughs> I'm just Ken, where I see the love she sees Now earlier in the evening, Ryan performed the nominated song from Barbie, which got Emma jumping out of her seat. That could have been the moment it happened. The final two nominated songs are from La La Land. In 2017, both Ryan and Emma turned down the chance to perform City of Stars, an audition from La La Land. To perform these two songs, please welcome from the film, executive producer and Academy Award winner, John Legend. But this year, seven years later, Ryan was all in to perform the Can Anthem? Who handled his own mic stand malfunction in the nick of time. I Ryan even gave Emma the chance to be part of the performance as well. During the commercial break between the presentation of Best Director and Best Actress, Emma did go hug Poor Things director Yorgos Anthemos and pointed out the wardrobe malfunction to him, but it would be just moments later that Emma figured she had to point it out to the millions of viewers watching too. <laughs> I think it happened during I'm Just Ken. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I genuinely do think I busted it during I'm Just Ken. I was so amazed by Ryan and what he was doing and that number just blew my mind and I was right there and I just was going for it and you know, things happen. <laughs> What'd you think of Emma playfully blaming Just Ken for a broken zipper at the Oscars this year? 